Back in 1180, there was a famous lady And when her husband's charm was fading, he went away crusading Went away to war and left her flat, she did not have time to think of that War is war, and in war she knew there was work that only girls could do So while the others were ballyhooing night and day She was doing quiet little acts of charity And what did they call that lady? Public sweetheart number one, loved by every mother's son. While her old man was away, she did one good deed each day. She should care if she was missed from the New Year's honors list. She had fame and much more fun as public sweetheart number one. When a crusader left his charmer, he had the girl encased in some little bit of his own armor, so she could keep her waist in. When the village blacksmith carefully hammered her into her lingerie, though she thrilled at the way it shone, she felt funny with a padlock on. And one minute after her man departed, stormy weather had started. Who do you imagine called on her but Richard the Lionhearted? How could she attempt to run when her costume weighed a ton? She just looked at him and sighed, Hot child, am I fortified? How on earth could she foresee he possessed the master key? And the fireworks had begun for public sweetheart number one.